What's up everybody, it's Andy here again from CryptoComparer.com to bring you another cryptocurrency related video. So in today's video we're just going to talk about two dApps that are doing well at the moment and got some good promotions and incentives going and still very early to mine. Um, we haven't been on lately bringing any new videos because I want to I want to stick true to my word. I don't want to be putting out videos daily or every other day just for the sake of putting these videos out. Um, not a lot is happening in Tron dApp space at the moment. Um, I say there are new games coming out some are dying some are being mined and then just dumped on the exchanges we had another failed launch from Trontopia which doesn't seem to have got off the ground yet which it is a real shame because I think a lot of people are looking out forward to that I have talked to the devs and they seem like genuine guys I just can't seem to understand why they can't get it live and can't get it going um, yeah but hopefully I mean fingers crossed they do get something launched but I think the damage is done on that side now with that one I don't think I don't think there's any confidence or any trust in that platform. Hopefully they they may be able to do something, get it fixed once and for all, and maybe run some sort of incentive to gain gain the players' trust. What I'd like to see in, in this space is more actual games, more games like I don't know, like Candy Crush or imagine Fortnite on Tron. You know where you could buy it, where you could buy a capture. No, I know that's a long way away from the mass adoption, but it's still it's still something that's good. Um, I mean, I was at the Malta Blockchain Summit last November, <clears throat> and we got speaking to some developers there with some really good games coming out um, on Ethereum. <clears throat> but I mean, if they can, if they can maybe write it for on the Tron blockchain, or I don't know, EOST, something which JavaScript based, something, something which you can get the game, and they can, or maybe do what some of the others are doing, where the actual game is off chain, and then you buy stuff with crypto on chain so yeah so any 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 other devs out there if see if something that you're doing and just this hit us up drop us a message or an email i'd love to see what's going on in that regard other than these these dApps and these these casino related dApps that are just invading tron having said that um i just want to tell you about tron egypt you know tron egypt have um an incentive going on still very 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 early to mind this now they're giving away 150,000 Tron to first. It's running till the 5th of May. You can see that's the person who's first at the moment has put 1.5 million Tron and wagered in. So, I mean, if the goes to pays down to 10th, there is actually other incentives as well. So you have this brick, and they did have a brick thing where it was like an additional um, mining pool. So you'd bet mine on dice. This is basically dice. You'd bet mine and bet mine on dice, and then you'd also get bricks depending on so much, and it'd be a centage. No, they have talk about ring and crash, nothing new, sticking to what everybody knows. Um, but it seems to be getting a loyal following. If we have a quick look on that review, you can see it is where we're we looking. So you can see it's forty second. No, this is this is going off players by default, not the volume. You can see there's 18 million 24 hour volume transactions going through. It's these decent decent figures and it is a new DAP. Um with the right mark with the right advertisement. They are doing paid ads on, on that review and and such as well. So it should get more players. Um there is a referral link, full disclosure as always. There is a link in the description below. It does help the channel if you use our link. You don't have to do the link, but any any referral commission is, is greatly received. It does help keep the channel going. So you can see we're still very on the very early stages. We're on stage one point one. It's three hundred tron to mine one of the Egypt coins, and three hundred and seven thousand five hundred thirty three have been mined so far. Um, it doesn't tell you how many have been frozen, which they should look into doing. To be honest, um, and we've got two hundred and thirty of them. So what I've been doing is just putting this on on sixty either over four or under 96 and then just letting it roll and then save them up here what they do do if we just tell you about the dividends is you can see the dividend they only pay out 30 percent of the dividend pool is distributed every 40 hours so the remaining 70 percent is left in the dividend pool so it stops it from not having any dividends in so it's, it's kind of like an overflow of dividends which is really good so the process so like it says the process of dividend di distribution is automated through smart contracts we know about this. Dividends can be drawn any time after the countdown. It will be accrued if you do not withdraw. Um, again, it costs you money to freeze Tron. So it's basically what happens is 
Um, I've done my withdrawal from the last one. You can see there's 31 hours left to the next payout. You can see if we don't mine this anymore, we don't play the game. We are mining, ain't we? It's we would get 193. The total payout would be 646 drum if we if we get that. You see, so it is worth doing on that. If we have a quick look at the white paper, we're looking at these standard white papers now. They all talk a bit about Tron now. It's 2,000 transactions per second, and I was better than Ethereum and TCR20. You can see here. So a bit more about the token and why. Whilst I'm talking about this one. They're going for this magic number now of 100 million. It's anything that's doing a, a billion tokens and stuff, 1,000 million, it's, it's too it's too saturated. There's not going to be enough price or scarcity in the coins to, to have any sort of effect on these exchanges. So the coin would be practically worthless after after so many mining stages. You can see 100% of the platform's dividends are distributed to Egypt coin tokens, um, coin holders. Um, Dividends automatically set for the smart track. That's the first distribution. Dividends will be distributed at a fixed time, which is 48 hours. The higher the proportion of your frozen Egypt coins, the more dividends you will obtain. 60% can be mined at the platform. The remaining 40% synchronistically unlocked as the mining progresses. So the devs, the promotion, the community, and the energy back are not pre-mined. Now a lot of these, a lot of these DApps that launch, they've already pre-mined and minted the tokens that they want. So then what happens is when it gets to a certain stage. You have the devs dumping their own tokens on the exchanges. We all know what happens. It's a decentralized marketplace. You can, it's proven it. You can see it. Just look what happened with Dutron. There was more coins in circulation than was what was frozen. And the good thing about this is there's more transparency now. And this is what I said in previous videos. We're looking at trying to get rid of the dead wood, shake out the charlatans, get rid of some of these these verified smart contracts, which are just clones of all the others, and get back to trying making these DAP space um worth talking about worth right doing youtube videos about worth people investing in um and i, th I think we see a lot of these contracts a lot of these dApps will 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 die die off as they look to build more more authenticity in this dApp space but yes you can see we're still in stage 1.1 a lot of the devs tokens have been mined um it's not on any exchanges that i know of yet um so that's a good thing. You can see the 20 mining stages. So it only goes up by 15 Tron every mining stage. And there is 500,000, half a million in each stage. So the right set of miners and stuff behind, behind this, it, it could take off. And let's say it's, it's very early stages on this now. Um, they're launching DICE. The Tron so the Master Architect event um, comes from an exclusive event pool of DICE. This is limited event once the total mine by all accumulates to one million tron the event pool will be distributed so that so then this is what it's talking about with the brick and stage ones and 70 percent going through top ranking is what they're running for now with the leaderboard which they're doing here with this event and then they've got additional promotions and events that they're going to look at later date tron crash um they're going to launch second quarter for those of you not familiar with quarters it, it's it goes within the financial year so january february march is q1 April, May, and June is Q2, and and so forth. So, it, so you can see that they're going to launch Crash, uh, hopefully May, probably ideally, and then they've got the Ring Game as well. Um, they've got community programs, referral program we talked about. Link in the description for that. If you want to play this game, go and click that link. And then they're looking at community plans and having some sort of engagement. And then this is the way we talk. They refuse to be forced to be listed on exchanges. We all know the exchange that's that's demoting these these DApps. And then what they're going to be doing at a later stage is buyback and burning, which is what the community wants now, which which creates the scarcity in the coins. And hopefully, with the right marketing, helps the price go up and down. You can see this is what they've got here. So they've got the white paper reading at the moment. They launched. They're going to launch the dice game, which they have. This di dividends distribution starts, which they're doing. Leaderboard starts. So then they launch. Um, Tron Egypt crash as well. So they're on, they're on, they're on, they're, they're on stage, or they're on, on they're on the milestones to, to launch crash soon, which is really good. Um, if we just come off this now, so yeah, I've been mining this either over four or over five, and then I've been mining it at sixty. So in that way, every five spins, I'm gaining one one token, which has worked out well for me. We've been mining it. Um, another one I wanted to talk about, well, it's come off my screen, is Tron 2. 
or Tron to you. So I was probably one of the first 30 people to get into this and I got into it by, I don't know, I found it now, I got into it by accident. But they had a bit of a bumpy start. They had to change the smart contract over, then they changed it over again to add additional coding and script to stop the exchanges from robbing the token, which you do think is good. If we just log in a second, you can see um, where we got. So with my just and fourth with 13,000, they've got an event on at the minute where you can win in 18 hours, you can win decent Tron. So I might have another, I might have another spin at that and just try and keep that going. Um, it is quarter past 11 at night here in the UK at the time of this video. So I may just leave it. Um, the tasks run on autopilot really. So as you do the task, you get the lottery ticket. They haven't really mentioned what they're going to do in the lottery ticket. It is mentioned in the white paper, which you've gone over in previous videos. Um, but they will be bringing this at a later date. And it is basically a loyalty based token to reward, which is run separate from Tron to you. So it'd be interesting to see how they, how they do this lottery. I think a decentralized lottery on Tron would be a brilliant thing. And I, I think it would be one where if it pays out and it's, and it's done in all fairness, in profitable furnace and stuff, and they're quite transparent. I do think it can take off. So the devs of T Tron to you take note on that. A link is in a, in below for Tron to you as well. You can see here that the dividends for this are really good now. So what they're doing, <clears throat> they're doing what, um, what I think some of the others done within every 48 hours to actually up in the price up in the round by 10. So you can see there's 18 hours left on now and it's to mine one TUC token is 530 Tron. It is quite easy to mine these, to be honest. I've just been putting it on like 55 or 60 and, and just doing every 10 spins. Um, you can see that we're online in 18 hours with 338. So that's just shy of, of 1% of what's been frozen. And we're going to get 872 Tron. And it's only 100,000 in the pool, which we, we all know is nothing. So yeah, I think this has got legs. I think this has got potential. It just needs a bit of promotion. If we look at dap space you can see it is starting to creep up at seventh now so you have got quite a lot of users but the minimum bet is only 10 tron so i do th so they've not got quite much in, in the volume but i do think that's a good thing because it gets the smaller players involved get, and as tron goes up in price i don't i, I for one won't be risking 100 tron i spend if tron's 25 cents so i think there's a lot of people who will be doing that anyway but if you can do 10 tron or you can do one Tron. I think I think the space have the DAPs have to move with the times and have to move with it with the market. So we turn we get this bull market, then it's going to go up as well. But yeah, two different two different DAPs. I just wanted to talk about two DAPs that are doing the same, doing some decent figures. Um, OCA DAP isn't doing much now since the Maserati competition. They've got all these 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 wallets, but you can see there's no volume. If you go, <coughs> I mean, we'll be we will be launching our own DAPs. That site in the near future and um, we've had a couple of issues with api and developers and we've had to put this on hold at moments but it is something that i'll be looking at a later date um i do not want to give the name away of the of the data of the domain but it is it is going to be one that's going to be well recognized in the near future um if you put it on to 24 hour about 24 volt hour volume it gives you a true reflection so tron bet has pulled it out of the bag now with tron live um, for those of you who've not checked Tron Live, it's basically slots um, built off chain, and then you, you basically transfer some Tron into it to charge it up to play with play money, and then you transfer your winnings back into, into Tron. But it's effortless, really good. I suggest you go and check it out. Links in the description for that. You can see on volume Tron Tron Egypt's fourth now if you base it on volume. Um, Dragon Castle it's kind of got off to a good start it seems to be a bit stagnant now um tokens were link, leaked onto a certain exchange which probably doesn't which probably hasn't helped it same as all of these we know bankroll the the bankroll contract is next to nothing now and they've turned it into more of a p3d uh, whether that be seen pokertron um really 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 like pokertron and um, pokertron seems to have just hit a stalemate to be honest it's taken them ages to hit that stage five and I actually thought that the fact that they were giving away an extra 1.5 million Tron in stage five, that it would be mined more than what it has been. But yeah, sleeper on Pokertron as well. But that's it until next time. Um, links in the description for all these. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel and you're new, please go ahead and click that red subscribe button. Turn on post notifications to be kept up to date with 
DAP related and cryptocurrency videos. And if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Till next time. Everybody, goodbye.